Hello, I'm Boris Lifkin. I'm the Northern California Regional Director with the California High Speed Rail Authority. And today I'm joined by... Jessica Zank, Deputy Director for the San Jose Department of Transportation. So as you know, we're making great progress in bringing high speed rail right here to Northern California and San Jose. What does it mean for downtown and for the surrounding communities when high speed rail gets here? Yeah, absolutely. High speed rail coming to downtown really links up the whole of Northern California and the Central Valley and eventually Southern California much more tightly. Do you want to talk a little bit about what the future of Deridon Station that the city would like to see through the Deridon Integrated Station concept plan will look like? The future that we're looking at has more than 100,000 passengers using this station every day. So we want a station that is up to that challenge and in fact more than that makes it really easy to use the station to get in and out from one mode to the other to transfer to high speed rail from light rail or a bus etc and also then is a real gateway to the city. Well May is bike month so why don't we get on some bikes and head on down towards City Hall through downtown San Jose and check out all the great bike infrastructure that the city's built out in the last few years. Now that we got to City Hall, let's talk a little bit about San Jose's plans for the future. So how does high-speed rail connect with the Envision 2040 general plan, the downtown transportation plan? What will that look like? The city's general plan is our blueprint for where we're going from here. And it envisions a city that instead of growing and sprawling out like San Jose had for a number of decades, continues to grow, but to grow up in the right places focused around growth like that enabled by high-speed rail. So just you and the city of San Jose have been really longtime supporters of high-speed rail. What are some of the things you've learned over, that, over those years and why have you maintained such strong support for the program? Well, the city of San Jose fundamentally believes that transportation needs to move into the modern era, needs to be electric, needs to be fit a lot of people into small amounts of spaces and that's exactly what high-speed rail does. Well, thank you for being here today, Boris. It's really been a pleasure. I think for everybody who's watching, I'd um, ask that you do two things. First, get out your bike, or if you don't have a bike, use bike share like we just did. It's beautiful out, it's start of summer, end of spring, bike month. Get out there and ride. Second thing, look for Move San Jose, coming to San Jose City Council in June. It's our citywide strategy laying the foundation for the future of mobility within San Jose. So thanks so much. Well, thanks again, Jess, for a great ride. It was lots of fun and love always hearing about great things that San Jose is doing. And of course, if you're interested in learning more about high-speed rail, you can visit our website, www.hsr.ca.gov. Have a great rest of your bike month, everybody.